Hi. It's beautiful out today, isn't it? Sure is. It's gorgeous. They're so clean, these ponds. I've been wondering, and I drove up here, I'm uh, from downstate, I'm with, uh, I have some friends in the community, we're into environment a lot, and we wanted to learn some about these ponds. Uh, and I've been wondering, where does it come in and where does it go out? I'm sorry, I, did, I didn't catch your name. Walter's my name. Nice to meet you, Walter. You seem a little out of breath. You've been running? Yeah, I've been running, exercising, and stretching. Uh, you look like stretching. you're in good shape. Yeah, I do. I do. I, I love it. I love my health. Can you tell me uh, where does where I'm does sorry, the, I didn't know what the question was. Where does the um, stream or the source come in, and where does it go out? From that end oh, to well, that, or from that to that? I, I couldn't tell you. But if you want, there's a visitor center. If you uh, go down to this path about 50 yards from here, take a right. It's uh, maybe half a mile down the road. There's a vis visitor center. Um, They'll tell you, or uh, if you want, yeah, that, I, I can that's take... That's a good idea. That's a good idea. All I right. think I'll do it, but um, I, I see uh, you strike me as someone official here by your manner and everything. Do, uh, do you that's, guard this? That's or... good. That's good. I want to I wanna stop, and now I want you to do the, the entire scene again um, silently, okay? Just silently. Let's, let's try it right from here. Amazing place this is. So peaceful. <laughs> wow. There's even a stream. Do you smell something weird though? Like you mean like the llamas? No, like kind of way weirder than the llamas. Well, not but you know, just kind of like bad, like kind of you know, like moldy. I assume there is some mold. I mean, it is a no, but mold. like major mold. You know, not just like like shower regular mold. Like majorly bad mold. Well, what do you mean? Well, I, so I read this article in the Times before it came. It was like a few months ago. Mm -hmm. You know, cover of the magazine, and it was about this this um, thing called um, toxic mold. Which toxic mold. toxic mold for real? Like it gets in the walls of these old houses, and then you know it seeps through all these cracks, like in this you know wood, these cracks in it, and it just it just like comes out, and it's all over the air, and you breathe it in, you don't even know you're doing it, and it I'm gets sorry, it gets in your brain. It, wow. Aren't you worried about breathing it in? I mean, don't you ever have concerns like this? Oh, it's just brilliant fresh air. What it's, else do you It's not about? brilliant fresh air. You're, con you're, you're being so condescending to me. You're being so... I'm having this experience. I'm, I'm, I'm afraid of this. And you're not even helping me out to see if it's here. Oh, I'm sorry. Why don't, you smell, why don't you smell that? Why don't you get up and let me smell that? Why don't you get right. up and let... Come on. You know, I'm sorry. You're really going to need to get up now. Just, just I'm not taking it too far. Okay? Just get up. Just get up. Just get up. Oh, all right, all right, fine. You don't need to get aggressive on me. Look, there, there must be some in there. There's going to be some in there. If nowhere else, there's going to be some in there, and there Where you're poisoned the by mold? it. It's ready just to be poisoned dirty. by it? It's just dirty. Come on. It's, 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 just... it's, it's in the trash Excellent. here. Great, great. Do you, feel the, do you feel the difference there? Yeah, I mean, I mean it felt yeah. a little bit predictable. I'm really not an actor. Hmm. I perform. I, I like that word. Uh, it's like communication. I share with people. It's, it's like uh, being in a tribe, a communal group who go out on hunts, do a lot of things together that's vital to their life. Yeah. Did you see I have both llamas and alpacas? I don't like animals. But animals are so cute and funny, you motherfucker! Huh? I'm gonna... Huh? <laughs> you didn't think I was gonna good. do that, did it's you? That's good, right? Yeah. yeah. Try it again, try it again. Because <laughs> you're so full of shit. I know. You know? I know. You're just I so know. full of shit. You just blab and blab and blab and blab and blab about, oh, oh you have to emote. And you have to give me some more. What What are you feeling what right are now? You feeling? I don't know. What you are you give, feeling? What are you feeling? What are you feeling? You want to give me? You no, I don't want to give you. What do you want to give me? What do you want to give me? 
fucking <laughs> pop you right in the face is what I want to do, but I won't. I won't because, uh, uh, you know, you know, I, 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 I used to, I used to, I, I used to collect um, stamps, and yeah. then, then I, 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 mm, I. But but you know it it seems, it seems so childish to do that and so so now I I I collect prints of artists who also um I, I, you, you could say about. something no I um do you like um artwork do you like yes, um, I, I told you I uh, love American your well no don't don't say that about my artwork I. I and curtain. Wow, that was, that was, I think that was pretty amazing. Oh. Yeah. Oh, it is. Um, That's interesting. So I was watching you today. I, I thought you were really talented. I think you're really good. Thank you. Yeah, it was very impressive. Mm -hmm. uh, where did you study? Um, Juilliard. Wow. Wow. So, you, so you don't you don't have to wear the you know like the Afghan the women no, with the no. thing. No, no, you you don't have to wear it at all. I bet that's hot. So what is it? Uh, what are you doing these days? Well, I'm here doing this. I'm, you know, I've been mostly modeling and now I'm getting into acting, but... No, you're very pretty. Thank you. Um, I guess I need an agent now, so... To help. Yeah, yeah, I guess they do. So, um, what agency are you with? Um, I'm, I'm with ICM. Wow. Who do you work with there? Um. In a lot of the Islamic countries, especially females, they just feel like, you know, they should cover their heads. And it's, it's, it's kind of bizarre to me that they should do that. It, it means that they haven't read the Quran or they haven't read it in their own language to know what it says. A lot of them can't read. Well, I, I don't know, whatever it is, but... It just, it, it, it mentions nothing of the kind, and I just don't understand how it's manipulated that way. And, and you know, when big intellectuals talk about the issue and warn people of the danger, mm. they get bombed and killed, and it's... it's right, right. Well, they have to go, you know, like, what's his, the satanic versus guy? Yeah. Excuse me? <laughs> he seemed distracted. Um, uh, I am. I am. My, um, to tell you the truth, um, I, I, I chose to leave this weekend to get away because my, um, I have a, I have a, a three-year-old son. Wow. And, yeah. That's beautiful. He is, he is, but he's very sick right now. Um. Oh, that's too bad. Yeah, they're, Does he have the flu or something? No, no, they, they recently discovered uh, uh, a mass um, the size of a, a tennis ball, which is very large for a, a three-year-old child, wow. uh, a t um, in, his, in his lung. Wow. And they don't know if it's malignant or if it's benign, and so they're doing the biopsy. And, um, you know, you, you can't anesthetize a child that age because it, it can really affect him later on in life. It can cause all sorts of uh, respiratory problems. And, um... Well, doesn't he have his mother with him? Are you still together with his mother? Or? Um, no, funny that you ask. I'm not still together with his mother, and so she's she's not being very kind. She's she's choosing this opportunity to play games and, and make him choose sides and... Make, make him choose things. sides? Yeah. So, uh... That's ridiculous. Yeah, um, and, and so, you know, I, I, I only have um, my partner, Marty, who... Uh, Are you he, gay? 
<laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I'm sorry. Yes, I, I'm gay. Um, but anyway, so I, sh I should be calling because um, I told them I would call them every night. And, Is that um, why you guys got divorced? Then? For many reasons we got divorced, but that was one of them, yes. Drama therapy was um, kind of came about in the in the twenties. Was developed by um, an Austrian, Jacob Moreno. He called it was called psychodrama then, which was more about reenacting trauma traumatic experiences from your life and then changing certain aspects of them um, to try to try out different options of behavior to see different uh, pathways for uh, behavior that might not have been apparent at all, that people can't find in themselves. And by talk, talking was not enough. So uh, really reliving these experiences and having the experience of trying out a behavior that, or behavior patterns that are totally new to you. People are here this weekend to deal with their trauma from the World Trade Center attacks. These are all performers. And my workshop in this retreat is specifically tailored to performers and to enhance their performance, to use fear, um, uh, to empower them, to empower their performances. So we're going to have some fruit for dessert. Are you going to have some? Uh, no, thank you. I I'm going to... Rachel said I can get some better reception up on the, the hill, so I'm going to try to call my son. Uh, I hope everything's okay. Uh, me too, thank you. Your concern. Mm -hmm. So, if you'll excuse me. Okay. What? Uh, come on, I want to show you something on the porch. Can I find it interesting? What time is it? What? Check this out. What is this? I don't know. What is it? I don't know. You tell me. You're the one who filmed the conversation between me and Aishan. And I also filmed another conversation with Bethany where you made up <laughs> another story about your life. Well, what, what are you, jealous? Do you, do you want me to have a little special private moment with you as well? Are, I'm sorry, are you, are you filming this? Is, is there, is Eric, there I think the around? point is that you signed up for this workshop to get to some No, you know what? I, when I signed fear. up for this workshop, I didn't realize what a freaking hack you were is what happened, all right? So, <laughs> Jesus Christ. I know you can portray trauma very convincingly. The point is that we're trying to get to some real fear. Here. Well, okay, if you want to find me some real fear here on this weekend and then call me because I'm going to go take a piss. You don't exist. Just stop. We're You're all the one existing. that's not fucking. You exist. You're all the therapist. You exist. You're the therapist. 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 You
Oh, don't harm it. Mm -hmm. now. You're trying to make me do something. I can't do it. I can't And you will exist when you stop. Don't exist. No. You were so good. You were so good. You were such a good llama. You were such a pretty llama. Yes. Mm, look at you. Look at your eyes. Hey, Walter. Hey, Rachel. Have you, have you had that the whole time? That... What, this? Yeah. It's nothing. It doesn't, it looks kind of bad. I don't, I don't, I don't think you should scratch it, you know? It hasn't been bothering me that much. Yeah, well maybe, maybe you should put something on it. I think we got some stuff, you know, calamine stuff, or like, I don't know, the tube, tube stuff. Is that working out for you? Mm, it's amazing. It's amazing. <laughs> amazing! I guess I, I'm not really into that. No? No, I, I can't get into it. I can't get into it. It's, I'm having difficulty with that. Yeah, yeah. It, it asks a lot of you. Yeah, I guess so. But it just seems kind of silly. I don't feel great about it. I don't feel great about my uh, performances. Yeah? Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know if it's me or, or what, but... Well, it just seems everything just seems weird. It just seems really awkward and... It just doesn't seem uh, like we're doing anything. Oh, shit. Shit. What is oh, that? I've got this I've got this fucking rash, too. God damn it. Does it hurt? Yeah. Fuck. It hurts? I gotta show somebody this, I think. That's disgusting. Don't get that on me. Yeah. And sometimes I just go into the bathroom and I want people to hear me scream, but I just can't bring it out of me because I don't want people to hear me scream. I just want certain people to hear me scream. And it just hurts too much look to really... This. Look at this. Look, Dandel, look at this. Look. Look, that's, it's spreading. It's totally, it's spreading. Yeah, I know it's some kind of rash, okay? It's like burning up my whole arm. It's like a, a, a bite. No, it's not a bite. It's, got a, it's like something up it's in the air. Walter's got it. We're probably I don't all think gonna it's get it. anything We're to worry about. Old. It's probably from those fucking ugly sheeps over there. I just really look, 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 look. Why don't we just why don't we just go show my father? He sees a do he's a doctor. He sees this kind of stuff all the time. Let's come on. Yeah. Oh, shit. Walter was itching. So his, his look just like that. Yeah, it was pretty much like it. But well, that's my father. I mean, he's a general doctor. He sees this kind of stuff all the time. So yeah. Dad. Dad? Yeah? Come out here for a second. I want you, I want you to check something out. Uh, yeah, what's up? Hey, what's Rachel. all that yelping going on up there? Uh, <laughs> we'll talk about that later. <laughs> all right. This is Rachel. Hi. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? Uh, Pretty and good. And she has this kind of rash on her. Oh, uh, so you do. Yeah. What happened? I just saw it, like it, it started to Well, she was also by the llama, she was it. feeding the, the alpacas, yeah. and, and it, so I don't know if Well, I don't think right. you're going to catch anything from them. This other guy yeah. has it, too. Yeah. Well, the only thing I know about dermatology is, is that if it's dry, wet it, and if it's wet, dry it. And it doesn't look like it's either. So yeah. we'll give you a little Benadryl, and that'll stop the itching, and it ought to just go right away. Okay. All right? All right. Okay. And what about, and you're getting too much sunburn. You love me. You love me. You love me. You need me. You need me. You need me. You love 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 me. You need me. Go. Time going. Time. Stone. Time. Time. Going. Rolling. Going. I don't. I don't feel this. I don't feel this. Okay. I see your body really kind of stiff. Let's let's try it again. Close your eyes. Okay. And just let the let the sound move your body. Okay. Uh, eh, uh, 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 u
tra trash trash hook um ar ars arson trash hook trash hook trash hook and the trash. and the, the shove knife the trash the tra pull your trash in pull your trash in it's, no it's burning it's burning, burning trash. Is, it's it's burning. you're burning trash burning. This, no it's fire it's smoke it's smoke it's your own burning smoke. trash soap deodorant soap hair we need some what hair stuff for this what's this this is that uh, hair my, body spray. For my dry scalp. All right, well, what is it? What do you need it for? I need, uh, look, I have bangs. I need to do There's something nothing with wrong my hair. Head. I, you, you, that, it's not going to, don't right, use well, that. It's my dry scalp. We All we have is baby oil, and we have uh, some toothpaste, so um, I'm sorry. It's but not going to do you any good. Well, man. let's it's see. Not, don't do me any harm, right? I, I, I'm telling you, it's not going to do you any good. Well, look. Jesus Christ. <laughs> uh, look, you're making a mistake. I, I don't want you to get okay. a problem with your hair look. and your scalp. Look, Walter, For crying I'm out loud. It back. No one will Jesus touch it. Christ. But in the idiots, they just, they completely sold that whole phenomenon short, you know, like like the transcendence and like rupturing the body and, mm -hmm. and deconstructing language and well, connecting the thought disability. to language. There was no, it was all disability. Dis yeah, there was nothing exploratory, nothing about, exploratory about, it. about it. And like, they didn't really get effect, like, affected emotionally by it. They didn't go on the journey. Mm -hmm. You know, I felt like something was always being held back by like this competition. And they didn't explore sound at all either. Sound or you know? the body or kind of a gro uh, an overall grotesque, uh, you know, grotesquery of the body of of thought, like words. No, no, you know? there was nothing with words. No kind of language whatsoever. And I found that like it just really made it much less interesting and dynamic. And cathartic, you know, you didn't go through anything with them because they didn't go through anything. Mm -hmm. Should I see this movie at all? I don't think so. No, well, I think I'll be really disappointed by it. I mean, there's. Really? Well, I mean, it has some, you know, some points hey, like Eric, the filmmaking. Where have you been? I... Oh, did I miss anything? Well, you've been making out with the llamas. You got that fucking rash on your, on your head. It's right in your hairline. Yeah. Oh my oh, god. Yeah. Can we see? Oh. Yeah, it's. Does it looks itch? Kind of bad. Bad. It's really... Oh my god. Does it itch? Don't, no, not really. I mean, a little thing. bit. I won't but, get it. No, I know what it is. Yeah, no, it Fuck. totally burns, right? <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's Walter. <laughs> that, that Walter? Sneaky, Walter? <laughs> that sneaky little weasel. He's such a little worm. He's a, yeah, he, he, he gave me hairspray back in the, in the, in the bathroom, and I, was, uh, oh I put it on God. my head. <laughs> Walter's, oh what, Walter's playing tricks. It, it, yeah, it's an inside job, and it's you know it's classic. It is absolutely classic because you, you know I mean it's it's, 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 it's what people, people have done since the beginning of time. I mean whenever whenever a country, um, I mean, gosh, it, it's just it blows my mind when I when I really think about it. It's, whenever whenever anyone has tried to take over a country or anything, I mean it, it just they, they, they you, you 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 reconstruct some sort of terrorist act and you blame it on somebody else and then you just swoop in and you take over and and who's gonna the, 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 you could hate your leader but then when they, when they save you from the bad people the the, the bad people or, or whatever you know you know what I'm saying. So where did you pick up all of that uh, firefighter lingo that you were spouting off over in that exercise with Daniel? I had an ex-boyfriend who um, was a fireman. What happened to the ex-fireman boyfriend? Well, he, he's dead now. Oh, I'm sorry. He died, in, I guess, in the line of duty? Yeah. Did, did, was he one of the ones on the... Yeah. Oh, wow. So he... He was real heroic and rushed right in there and rode that bull to the ground, right into the depth of the earth. Right? What's wrong with you? <laughs> What's wrong with me? <laughs> Don't give me that. <laughs> Don't give me that. Hey, 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 hey! Oh, hey! Dandel, Jesus Christ. Dandel, what, what are you talking about? What do you, what do you mean, what am I talking about? He put you up to this. Put me up to what? I'm sorry, you're, you're actually, I, I, you don't know what I'm talking about.
you're a jerk. You're a jerk. It's the right thing to say. You're a jerk. You're an idiot some of the time. You're an asshole. I didn't mean to hurt your feelings, and I'm really, really sorry. I, I've kind of been at odds with Dandel. He thinks I'm lying. Well, I am lying. He caught me lying. To, well, the, you know, this story to you about my lying. lover and wife and child. And, you lied to me about that? And to Aisha well, and all you that lied stuff. to me about yeah, that? Yeah, I did. It's, you know, I, I'm... I'm. Well, what I what I said is true. I, I realize and that, and I, now, I I'm sorry. Now he's dead, and it, he he's a hero, and, 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 and he treated me like shit, and I was... Just, I, and I can't do anything about it now. There's nothing that I can do. He was he was an asshole. He was a complete asshole, and now he's a hero. Now he's a hero because all he did was go to work one day. Why'd you, why'd you come here? I just, I wanted to see if you were okay, you know? <laughs> I mean, we couldn't just let you sit up here all by yourself. You should, you should care that, that I'm, I'm okay. Yeah. I mean. You see what I was doing, right? Yeah. Yeah, I, you can't, yeah you, uh, we've, we've, we've figured I, I, it I out. I can't be in the present with, with, with women. Some of the time I'm right back with my mother. I'm sick and I, I, it's my my, my dad told me that you should never touch someone's knee because it makes them go. Go. Go touch your knee. Go like this. Mommy. Bitch. Bitch. That word comes up. You don't deserve it now, but I got it ready to spit out my fucking lips, you know? Bitch. I don't even have to put voice to it. Bitch. I told you I was going on this retreat two weeks ago. It's, I don't know, it's, it's a, this drama therapy, I don't know where we are. It's, uh, it's this group of, I don't know, there are six people, six, five, six people here, and uh, it's on somebody's farm, and it's drama therapy. It's people involved with, you know, the, the tragedy. But it's, it's crazy, actually. I, I, I don't know if you'd want to, but there's this one guy up here. His name is Walter. You have to see him. No, I know, no, he wouldn't, it wouldn't be. No, really, you do. You have to see him. He's... I, I, I can't even describe him to you. Well, he's... I don't know. He's like about 5'7". He's got a beard. Listen, it, that doesn't matter what he looks like. Well, actually, it does matter what he looks like, but... All right, Marty. Who's playing? Are you hungry? How old is your brother? He's 18. He's just... Uh... He just graduated from high school. Just had his prom. <laughs> wow. Do you play instruments? I, I played piano when I was a kid. Yeah. Why don't you invite him down here, for God's sake? Yeah. Uh, he's a little shy, I don't know. Oh, well, you're a therapist. So after Springsteen, it was the jazz music, the saxophone player that got you into all this. Uh, John Coltrane. Which what um, do you know any of his stuff? You know Blue Train. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you uh, can you play uh, a little bit yeah, sure. for the, the the ladies? Oh, the, sure. the, it's the drummers and then sax players get laid the most. So it's, uh, that's true. Okay. <laughs> This guy, <laughs> come on! <laughs> Can we play a little bit more. Yes. <laughs> wow. 
Wow. You found Walter? And Walter had a total breakthrough. Really? Yeah. He totally, like his whole anger, all the anger issues. He totally figured mother. out why he terrorized us all. <laughs> Eric. Rachel. <laughs> Terrorist. No, please. I'll I'm let sorry. him tell you. Because it was really great. Yeah, I should tell you. I gotta tell you, I'm pissed at you. Yes. Um, it, for a lot of reasons. Okay. It's really hard to tell, but the, I, I, I know I owe you this, and I know I owe people in general mm -hmm. here. Uh, yes, I needed attention. I wanted attention. That's a given with me. Mm -hmm. I'm a narcissist. Mm -hmm. But, um... I think we're all narcissists I really, here. I, I, I see bullshit in the actor's stuff. Mm -hmm. Not that acting is always bullshit, but I see some of this, so much of this bullshit, and I wanted to give people something tangible to feel, something like they would really start to worry about. I saw that. I saw it. I went, after you left, I saw that. I, I like I like emergencies, mm -hmm. but I really didn't create one. I just made people think that. I understand you, Walter. I'm not happy with everything you're doing here, but there's some good things happening. I'm really, I do feel comfortable enough to s speak to you, and I really appreciate it. <laughs> Guys, I have um, some envelopes here with just some little things to think about to keep in mind for the exercises tomorrow. So just open them up, don't show anyone else what you're saying. I'm in the into the news. Do the news up, but do the news up. <laughs> Let's hold up this one. Um, this is my mother, everyone. Hi. 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 Michael, I brought you some watermelon and some book spray. Okay, this next exercise, I'm going to split you off into two groups, and you're going to direct your own advertisements for the fear of the unknown. Um, Aishan, mm -hmm. you're going to direct Eric and Rachel, and Walter, you're going to direct myself and Bethany. So let's do it. I'm going to give you each a cameraman, and as quick as possible. We have a half an hour to do this, one take only. All right, you're um, on the subway in New York, and you have a suspicious package on you that you're about to do something pretty bad with it, all right? And <laughs> Eric, yes. uh, you're going to notice that, but you're going to keep your calm, and then we're going to get to your close-up after that, all right? Okay. Ready? Camera rolling. Subway. Action. I just, I don't get it. I don't understand. Like, is this supposed to be, like, I'm going to blow him up and he's completely oblivious to it? Like, is it that stupid? Are you saying that, like, he is an well, American? Okay, okay Rachel, let's, let's just not get into that right now. Uh, I just want to finish this because we have, I don't know, about maybe five minutes or so. Okay, uh, let's just do his close-up and then if you okay. want to talk, we'll yeah, talk, all right? All right, we'll do Eric's okay, close-up. Okay, Eric, this is what I want you to do. Mm -hmm. I want you to turn your head towards the camera. Right. And then this is going to be your tagline or something to that effect. Okay. I used to live with the fear of the unknown. Now I don't fear anymore, or something like that. I don't know. Okay. However you want to phrase it. All okay. right. All right. Uh, you feel I'll pretty try. good. Yeah, Ready? yeah. I'll try, I'll try. Okay. Um, Ready? Me. Well, let me, let me, let me think for a second. Okay. All right. All right. Rolling. Action. There's a lot to fear in the world. I used to be afraid. I used to fear the unknown. But now I think it gives me an edge. <laughs> that is totally ridiculous. 
Tasha. Well, I mean, no, look, I'm sorry, do you see what just, you're doing you now? You just ruined the close-up yeah, right okay, now. Yeah, okay, but you're like taking this thing, you're taking like this actual right. fear that people have been experiencing. I am I think sick what you're trying to, say to is death. Just calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Shut up, Eric. Shut Being totally, up. totally. I'm totally free. I'm free. I'm free. I'm leaving. Now transform. Transform. This is the next step. Now transform. What? From a place of real fear. Use the transformations. Use what we did yesterday. I'm sorry, this was all just an exercise? I needed to get you here to experience true fear. I'm sorry, Daniel. I don't accept it. This is ridiculous. Transform. You guys were just playing here. Transform from here. From here. From I'm here. Sorry, go this back. This is so wrong. I shouldn't go back. Go back into it. Go back into it. Rachel, continue. 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 You don't just sit back and cry. Now transform. You know, fucking stick up for yourself. If you're <laughs> yeah, scream. Go ahead and fucking scream. Go ahead and fucking scream and pull up your goddamn grass shit. Your boyfriend and girlfriend living together, uh, promoting fear of the un unknown mm -hmm. um, by gathering food and supplies mm -hmm. in case there's a dirty bomb. Honey, can you pass me the, the, the fruit? Can, the canned fruit there, and I'll get the green beans here. Now, why don't you do it? Well, I am doing it, and then you're going to get that, and then I'm going to get this. What are you this. doing? I mean, what are you, you I'm, doing? You're doing I'm it this time? I'm, you're going to do something around here? I am. We're doing something. I'm packing the things First in the bag. First time I've seen you do anything. For... You find that you're going to do something now? Yeah, well, well, we're doing it. We're doing it together. Oh, that sounds like fun. What? Let's do something together. How come uh, I shouldn't? I didn't know what was happening out there. Oh, well, we got these envelopes from Dandel about mm -hmm. the exercise last night. Mm -hmm. And he said they were all positive reinforcements. You know, but uh, ours had secret instructions. Yeah. The, I, to, I be, just... to be negative, you know, and like kind of throw her off. Yeah. And I, Which I, I guess thought was completely perverse and... and, and... Well, you I know, just didn't feel like participating. it was just mixing it I up a little bit, but yeah, but that's it's she just, got upset and and you know Eric didn't. It's hurtful. It's abusive. It it shouldn't. It's it's manipulative. Oh, and, and we were just you know following instructions. I mean, I was just trying to do the exercise. Dirty. Oh, you take all that stuff out of the post, you can see that. So, so I got a lot of money riding on this. You know. You're gonna love it. Okay, good. It's so hard to catch people's attention these days. The thing that the most compelling thing is real emotions, fear, especially fear of the unknown. It sells so much more than desire. You know, we hired a bunch of actors who are basically playing themselves because we wanted them to really get into this stuff, to draw on all this real trauma, this real fear they have. Otherwise, it wouldn't be you wouldn't give a shit. Um, so we use the 9/11 thing, okay, controversial, whatever. But the thing is, is that people want to transform. They're sick of being themselves. They want to get out of themselves. They want to try out different roles, different ways of being. And this is what the shoes are, are giving them the chance to do. Oh my god! Jesus Christ! Ah!
ground cut!